Catch your breath because the next match should be every bit as good. Triple the fun with triple threat action next. I'm getting goosebumps anticipating this one. It's a false count anywhere match and it happens here coming up next. Making his way to the ring, weighing in at 275 pounds, Luke Harper. Guys, as we all know, these Falls Count Anywhere matches can become incredibly dangerous. That's right, Michael. In the past, we've seen these matches spill out into the crowd where everything from chairs to tables to television cameras have been used as weapons. Japan, weighing in at 287 pounds, Tank Key Morris Tia. Here we go, guys, the triple threat match we've all been waiting for. And any time you get to see these superstars compete in the same ring at the same time is a real treat. Here comes the King Slayer! Seth freaking Rollins, the King Slayer, the architect, undeniably one of the best superstars WWE has seen this generation. And from Davenport, Iowa, Weighing in at 217 pounds, the Ring of Honor World Television Champion, Seth Rollins. Seth Rollins has made a career out of taking risks and seizing opportunities. Seth Rollins has been a multi-time champion, a Money in the Bank ladder match winner, debuted as part of the Shield 
with Reigns and Ambrose. The King Slayer set for action. I would be remiss if I didn't mention, oh, and it's important to remember amidst the chaos of a triple threat match, that victory can be achieved in... He's looking at it. Is he done? Nicely done as he gets out of the submission. Color me surprised, Michael. I did not see that one coming. You gotta believe this one's over. Up. What a strike. Ooh. To the... This might be it! Oh my! Yeah, right to the back of the neck! Yeah, right to the back of the neck! Luke Harper starting to stumble now. Looks like he may have let his guard down there for a moment, and it cost him. Well, he's clearly not used to competing in a match like this, and it's starting to show. I'm not going to go so far as to say he can't win this match, but things certainly aren't looking good for him right now. Using the elbow as a weapon. Oh, as we tear the features clean off your face. Beautiful technique. He might have it. He looks to be losing a bit. How'd he do that? I don't know, Michael, but good thing. I don't think he could have taken much more of that. thinking about what to do next here. Well, better not think too long, though. Harsh impact. Well, guys, the referee should have it relatively easy here tonight because, as you know, in a false count anywhere match, anything goes. Back in the ring now. Oof. Showing off some of his speed there. What a stomp. Good grief. Hard to argue your take on this match, Michael. When there are no rules to enforce, the official sole responsibility in a match like this is to simply declare the victor. Yeah, the referee may only have one job, but I'm still willing to bet he finds a way to mess it up. He goes down hard. Right in the mouth. Oh, Relent. Oh, the referee better get a hold of things. Boom, right in the button. Oh, nasty impact. When it comes to falls count anywhere matches, for my money, there are a few. Harper getting the shoulder up. Might have slipped there, Cole. Seth Rollins finds a way out. Eventually, John Cena and Seth Rollins changed the landscape of the match by doing the one thing they never considered, 
and that was working together. The Beast survived three consecutive AAs from John Cena and a curb stomp from Seth Rollins. Cena and Rollins then went toe-to-toe -to -toe as one tried to take the other out of the match. All three superstars suffered an incredible beating, which included Brock Lesnar being treated by two doctors at ringside after surviving. And a quick pin attempt by Luke Hart. It's going to take a lot more than that to keep him down. Way too early. Knocked him right off his feet. Yeah, no kidding. There he goes, crashing to the floor. Harsh impact. He gets him with a reversal. Down he goes. That was impressive, Cole. He's left wide open here. I don't think he even realizes it. He looks dazed. It's about to get bad. That was nowhere near a three count. Not yet. Oh, boy, he is rolling. Luke Harper visibly losing steam. The chances of winning this triple threat match are starting to dwindle. In a back and forth match like this, he has to do everything and going for it all here. Seth Rollins starting to look a bit weak now. The exhaustion's kicking in. Seth Rollins blends and he escapes the submission. And good thing, that could have been disastrous. Nope, reverses it. Carry. This doesn't look good, Corey. Couldn't agree more, Cole. This has got trouble written all over it. Are you kidding me? Oh. I'm not sure how much he has left. Going back to Seth's knee, I'm one to know that injuries are fair game, and Seth was exposed to the world when he crumpled to the ground that night against Kane. You know, I actually agree with you, Corey. Any submission specialist needs to make that knee a priority. It also neutralizes Seth's biggest moves and keeps him from the top rope. Is that enough for the win? Harper getting the shoulder up. Not yet. Some superstars who've competed in a triple threat match feel it's a good idea to have both a finishing move that brings you to a pinfall attempt on your opponent and a submission move. Oh boy, he is rolling. Not enough to end this one. It's gonna take more than that. Here he goes. Down he goes. That'll do it every time. Byron, before you mention the strategy some superstars have implemented for competing in the triple threat match, and that includes having a finishing maneuver to put someone away for the 1-2-3 and a submission to make them tap out. There are many superstars in WWE who can pace Larian. Now that's what I call making a statement. There's the cover. Can he do it? He's got some fight left in him. Definitely has his work cut out for him. Right between the shoulder blades into the pump handle. Not sure where he got this much energy, but he's definitely feeling it. Here he goes. Yeah, right to the oh. back of the neck. That's called making a statement, Cole. Seth Rollins just changed the momentum of this match. Dodges that one. This might be it. Oh, my. you got to believe this one's over. Rollins fans have... He's going for the pin. True testament to Gret. He just powered out there, Cole. There's a big reversal by Seth Rollins. How good is Seth Rollins? I can't help but be impressed by these three superstars, guys. This has been absolutely intense. Oh! What a nasty!
nasty big boot by Harper. That's why you don't get in the ring with Luke Harper. Here's a cover. Could be it. Two. He kicks out before three. Can you believe what he's withstood here tonight? And here comes Luke Harper. There he goes, crashing to the floor. Seth Rollins got out of there in the nick of time. They should count his lucky stars. Here he goes for the win. What is keeping this competitor going? He needs to change something fast, guys. He showed up here tonight for a fight, and that's exactly what we are seeing. Here is Luke Harper in position now. Here we go a second time. Oh, what a discus clothesline! Took his head off. Game, set, match. This one is over. Bold move going forward again. And he kicks out. I can't believe what we're seeing here. Oh, he's such a tough target. And he's heading back in. Boom, what impact. Got the leg. There's the pin. One, two. I wouldn't have been surprised if that was it. Wow. Just when you thought it was over. Wow. Harper, just too quick. Deceptively fast. His shoulders are down. Real close, too close for comfort. How'd he do that? Oh, the architect is rolling now. Seth Rollins got on a dangerous path there. Great move by the architect. Dodges a bullet there. And this has got to be it. Given what we've seen so far, it's almost too bad that two of these superstars will walk out of here as losers. He's got the shoulders down, and he manages to get the shoulder up. I don't believe it. He refuses to lose. He's making a statement here with this attack. What a strike. Here we go. Back inside the ring. Ooh. Not gonna lie, that would hurt. He might have it. Whoa! <laughs> Seth Rollins gets out of trouble and quickly. We've got a cover. One! Two! Never say die attitude out of him. This is amazing! Quick thinking to avoid that one. Incoming! Looks like Luke Harper has a few things on his mind. Oh no, Luke Harper looking to finish it. Harper is in position. Here it goes. He could pin his opponent right here. Barely at two and a half. I can't believe it. He just won't go away. Caught in leg. Oh boy, he is rolling. Taking off his feet here. And it's moves like that that make him so dick. He goes for the cover. Oh, and he breaks up the pin. He's got him covered. Came down hard there. That might be hurt. His shoulders are down. Two! He's got to be running on empty at this point. Well, Seth Rollins reaches deep and finds the will to survive. I expect nothing less. And now, oh, what a clothesline. Forcefully delivered. 
That has got to be it. Seth Rollins is it. The shoulders are down. Two. Three. What a victory. What a triple threat. Triple threats always deliver three times the action, and that one was no exception. Take a look. Oh, I can't believe this. He's getting it done here. Check this out. No doubt about it, he brought his A game, as you can see here. Here is your winner, Tank Key Morris Tia. What a grueling match. It looked like anybody's match there toward the end. I strongly suggest Seth Rollins dedicates some more time to doing homework on his opponent. There's a lot of notes he can take from tonight. Hey, Seth Rollins is a true student of the game. And it'll be interesting to see the ripple effects this win has in the weeks to come.